In this video, I will take you through my typical day as a mechanical engineer working in the education and research environment. Hi everyone, my name is Adrian and welcome to my channel. I make videos covering topics of engineering and Python programming and how to use them together or separately. If this is your first time here, welcome. Please consider subscribing and if you like what you see or just found it very entertaining, please do give it a thumbs up. So I work at a university as an engineering lecturer. A lecturer role has three components to it. Lecturing, researching and admin. I am part of the mechanical engineering and automotive engineering cluster and I teach engineering kinematics and engine simulation predominantly. I also help out with other subjects where I lead their tutorials. The lecturing role requires me to create a lot of written content. I have experimented with some word processing software and have left Microsoft Word a long time ago. I can still use it, but I just, I just don't prefer it. I love creating beautiful typeset documents. I see it as a form of art and I find pride in generating professional looking documents that will be read by others. And my number one software for generating great looking documents is LaTeX. It's not that user friendly and it almost looks like you are programming something when you write a document, but man, it makes beautiful rendered content. The only downfall is that it creates PDFs, which is not the best format if you are looking to create accessible content, especially in a university environment. So I also use Markdown to generate the majority of my content that is used by others to ensure it's accessible and caters for every need out there. Apart from creating learning content, I also actually teach the content. The past year, everything needed to be online, which was new to me as well as the students. Hopefully we can get back to face-to-face -face teaching for the next academic year. Fingers crossed. Now teaching is not all I do. I'm also involved in really cool research projects. My past research focused on engine emissions reduction using renewable fuel, and I'm still doing research in that area. The university campus is slowly opening again, so I'll be able to show you around the engine test cell and some of my current research projects. Let's go. I have started some research on drone propulsion, which is really exciting. I'm planning some high level simulation as well as building a proof of concept test rig. Now for the test engines. We recently acquired new test cells. They still need to be commissioned, but I'm really excited to get started experimenting and validating some simulations. I did my PhD using this engine and have a complicated love-hate relationship with it, to be honest. For now, I'm still working from home with some trips to campus to do tests and commission validation test tricks. Hopefully, I will be back in the classroom for the next academic year. Thanks for watching.